Here's the configuration for the Bass B. The important thing, the Jack Outlaw 277 kit. You can see that it increases the damage in a very, very disgusting way and the bullet velocity. Rate of fire goes to almost nothing. Aim down sight speed affected. Let's have a look at this thing on the field of honor. Look at there, the game just started and I'm already dead. I'm kind of nervous about using this weapon in free for all. I'd be much more comfortable with the XRK Stalker or the Longbow. But nervous like excited too, to give it a whirl. Kind of like when you're holding the brakes about to go out plug in the burner on the runway for that first flight after the training unit when they send you out on your own. Go there. We're going to go cruising. This weapon is a precise weapon. If you don't have a precise shot, I'd stay with the standard Bass B. I felt like I could have won easily with just the standard Bass B, but then the Jack Outlaw kit will get you out. Oh, look at our, there's ice cream. Ice cream's coming after me, and he gacks me. It can get you out of trouble. The Jack Outlaw 277 can get you out of trouble. You, you can, there's ice cream again. Oh, golly. He's gonna, he's gonna bang me in the head. That's pretty rude. Okay. Oh, there's somebody else's proximity mine. And I kill him before that mine kills him. Because I want to kill. Somebody laying down on top. That's pretty gutsy and free for all. <laughs> Whoops. Got got double double machine gun jubblies there. Guy's laying down again. There's ice cream, and he just destroys me. I always, I always checked up there for that uh, recumbent, tired player up there taking a breather. I said it can get you out of trouble. The one thing about it that I just wish was different a lot. There's machine gun jubblies. A lot different was that every time I, you pull the trigger that's it that may be the only pull you get the speed rate of fire is not nearly what I expected like at least one every second and there's jubblies looks like she's changed her her tune or her weapon there so I get another machine gun there gonna put it right whoop right back up there they destroyed my other one very quickly and I have a trophy to put by it these things always kill me in free-for-all they're not killing anybody else and they destroy it in no time there's ice cream got them again I don't know why I didn't pull the trigger remote turret all clear that means it's dead so there's my second cruise missile in this game and I don't know what happened there, uh, whether somebody shot it down with a storm bringer or there's some sort of a device that's out, but it never hit the ground that I could tell. Now, wait a minute. The remote turret's still still up there. And there's somebody, somebody trying to destroy it. That's my property they're messing with. Of course, you got to hit the person. Like I said, there's Jubblies. She switched the knifing, and it's the tie game here. Can't ask for more than that at the end of the game to be tied. It gives you a chance to win. We're tied at 27. I'm taking shots. Ice cream gacks me, and I'm pretty sure he's the king at that point, so that's not a not a good thing. In fact, it's a very bad thing. There's ice cream. Now, it's a good thing. Yeah, he was the king. It's a good thing when you kill the king. We're tied at 28. Just need two kills before ice cream gets two. Desperately searching for a prom date here. Ice cream has 
one more kill to get. There's one for me. I'm at 29, and I'm a loser. Second place is the first loser. So what did I learn in that one? Well, basically, like I said, you got to be precise with the Outlaw 277 kit on the Bass B because follow-up shots are pretty rare. So Das House, this is a charnel house. They ought to rename the thing. It's a meat grinder. Bullets come from everywhere. Look at there. My first miss, I kill a guy, and I kill myself. I figured I'd be a sitting duck. Because everybody strafes with their SMGs and their shotguns. and <laughs> There's a miss. Two misses in a row. And the flinch, it's not supposed to be bad, but when I got hit, I flinched. There's a comeback. I'm down by three early on. Never a good sign. I don't get concerned until I'm down by five at 26. Yeah, I don't know how I missed that one. Must have had some sort of a tick. Spasm in my... Look at this. Look at all these people. There's a rabbit running back and forth looking for Easter eggs. Somebody kills them. And of course, if somebody kills the bunny, you got to kill that person. You got to gack them immediately. Grenades flying everywhere. Mannequins making you think that's another enemy. Hop around, turn around, shoot. And then die to a proximity mine. The Bass B, the outlaw, is particularly good at very close in fighting. I know that the ADS is really slow, but a quick scope on this thing is deadly. I always went for the head, even though if you hit the hands in the kill range, which is 22.4 meters in this configuration, it's a one-shot kill. There's the Easter Bunny. Oh, forget what I said about shooting the person that shoots the Easter Bunny. There's two misses. I'm not going to miss a third time when he's standing in front of me like Darth Vader. So I know I'm dying a bunch. I'm down by eight kills at this point. And I'm thinking, I'm never going to put this one on YouTube. <laughs> At least you, get, you guys, uh, nobody will accuse me of being in a bot lobby. Maybe they will anyway. So I do some hopping and some chucking and jiving. And how could that guy survive a mine blowing up at his feet? That would have been my kill. That was my kill. So now I'm down by five. Okay. Make that six again. I'm going to have to put together a streak. Or I'm not going to get the prom date, which is the last kill. Sorry, bunny. The Everetter bunny. He doesn't go forever. Not, with, not when he's gacked down by five again so I've reeled in Elvis by three ah. bullets flying everywhere to the left of me to the right of me in front of me behind me luckily the guy went in the corner made it easier to hit and I don't know how I missed that guy that time the proximity mine worked so now I'm only down by two I've reeled this thing in that was that was the king that was Elvis and you can see that <laughs> thank you for running in front of me I'm tied now I can't believe it you can see that you could be getting hit you get one shot on the guy and he's gone he probably thinks you're you're bo not boosting um, that you're on steroids some aftermarket steroids and Strangely enough, I found the prom date. I won that one. I don't think I went positive. There's the last kill.
Let's see. Yeah, we barely went positive on that one. That that one was a meat grinder. So here's good old shipment. I know, I know I've played free-for-all on shipment a couple of times, so I know somebody's going to be coming that way. Trying to gack me. And I'm up by two. We're leading the pack here. We're the head dog. Everybody else's view, all the other dogs' view on the sled team is the same. That was rude. Darth Vader should have used magic and not a sword. Somebody looking for Easter eggs probably crouched over there walking along. There's Greenhead. Like I said, at point blank range, this thing is an eliminator. Yeah, that person was a real pain walking around with that swarm and the the big mag, and that person could move. See, didn't kill him. Proximity mine didn't kill that guy. He was standing up trying to go down, but he was standing up. So I'm dying about as often as I'm not. Hoping that the mine will do work. And that would have been good. Turn around, get the double kill. But of course it didn't happen. See if anybody's camping. Impress my friends with jumping, chucking, and jiving. Hope that proximity mine will do some work. Up, oh. <laughs> yeah, the king. I reeled him in one. I'm, I'm behind again. Find myself behind by three. Don't know who he was shooting at? It was Shaft. Shaft was shooting at somebody else. Oops. Screen head. Down by one. And some guy, I, I, I should have muted him, but he was giving some soliloquy about companies that own all the real estate and some such stuff. I don't know where he gets all that from, but there you have it. Talking constantly, a running commentary, miss, hit, and I'm down by one halfway through the game. I tell you, the stress, you could cut it with a butter knife. It is so thick. That didn't look like I hit him, but evidently uh, I get the kill anyway. <laughs> I stood there and waited for his grenade to explode at my feet. Like a good casualty. Now I'm down by four. Three. Darth Vader's trying to hit me, but trying to rend my soul there. Looking for a date. It's not the prom yet. It's not the last kill, but just looking for a date. There's a date. And somebody else gets it. The Easter Egg Hunter. There's double jubblies there. Or the Swarm Man. Mr. Swarm. Love following people with this gun because you have time to line it up. There was the Swarm Man. And that helps. A, a quick three kills, free for all, helps. Dying right after, getting gack does not. Okay, there's 28, I'm three behind at 25, 29, I'm three behind, so I need to get four kills before somebody gets one, which the odds of that are pretty low. And it was the guy that was talking the whole time. Now we need three more. One. There's Darth Vader. Friendly man. There he is again. Two. Let me see if I can get this guy. Three. And we get the win. Pull it out. Pull victory from the jaws of defeat. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Helps me. Helps the family. Worth another look. Cheers and peace.